Hi, I'm Tara Winfrey with Coldwell Banker. Let's talk open houses and agency for a second. Here's the scenario. You're hosting an open house. It is not your listing. Somebody comes in and wants to have a substantial conversation. They want to talk about price or repairs or settlement dates, whatever. But before you can answer that question, there's a few things you need to know. One, is that person already working with an agent? If the answer is yes, the follow-up question is, is the agreement in writing? If the answer is yes, go ahead, answer the question. But if the answer is no, they are not working with an agent, you have a follow-up dialogue you now need to deliver. As of July, the state of Virginia requires that it be in writing whether or not I represent the buyer or the seller before I'm allowed to have a substantial conversation with anyone about this property or any property for that matter. So during this conversation, would you rather me represent you, the potential buyer, or the seller? Hopefully they say me, the potential buyer, and in which case you whip out your buyer broker agreement and you have them sign it, even if it's only for that house and for that five minute period of time. But most open houses I've been to, most consumers are gonna say, say what? What did you just say? All I wanna know is, and in which case you whip out this magic form. And you say, it sounds to me like during this conversation, you don't mind being unrepresented. This form says that I represent the seller during this conversation and that you are unrepresented. Go ahead and give me your magic autograph and I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. Hope this is helpful. I'm Tara Winfrey with Coldwell Banker.